right. We about to see if we can find a house. Let's see what it looks like over here. Welcome to the replay viewers. And welcome to your live viewers. About to go check out this house over here. I think it's a two bedroom, one bath. Um, this is what the neighborhood looks like. And we about to see what they about. What's up, Daniel? You been on that club house some more? Okay, so what's up on this little quiet street here? They got two dumpsters at this house, so somebody was doing some serious work at this particular house right here. Two dumpsters. That's when you know you got trash. So yeah, our subject property is coming up here in just a momento. I think it's at the end of this street here. But yeah, cute little neighborhood. Looks alright from what I can see. I hope it looks like one of these houses. What's up, Lucy? Oh man, this thing's at the bottom of a hill or something. What the heck? Ugh. Mm, that's not it. Well, it's saying. What house is that? They got a dumpster in their yard, too. What house is that? Oh, that's our subject property up there on top of the hill. So now that I can see, we got that house next door, somebody working on. And then we got that house there. That's our subject property. So let's see what we got. Go up this hill. Get stuck. Don't get stuck up the hill. Got a big front yard. If that means anything. And I'm going to stop about right here. I don't be liking to pull up too close on these uh, houses sometimes. So that's how we do it. So give me a second here. We're going to go check it out. Matter of fact, hold on. Let me switch that up. Put that right back for a minute. Oh, wow. That looked good there. Nice and bright. Uh-oh. What did I do here? I accidentally pushed a button. So we're going to go check out this house. See what it's talking about. It's been vacant for a little bit of time. I do like that it has a nice front yard. And we're about to see what they about. So if you could give this video a thumbs up. Give it a like. Give it a share. We're about to try it out. Oh man. I'm getting old. We're getting old outside. So we're going to go check this house. So hopefully it's not too bad. Let me let y'all see what the neighborhood looks like. So I don't know. No houses across the street. Like a lot of like uh, open, roofs. a lot of leaves, but that house next door is vacant as well, I guess, if they got that big dumpster, I guess. And then this is our subject property right here. We're going to see if we can buy it. It needs some work. Now, what work it needs, I'm not sure. We're about to find out. Uh, they gave me the lockbox code. Hopefully, I can get in. So, the first thing I see looking at it is we want to. Check out, make sure it's all good. Big area, yeah. Who wants to be in a big thing like this? Like this big hill. What if this was all ice? You would have to slide down the dang old thing to get back. But here's our property. Got a little backyard. And I guess that's the lockbox right there. I'll see it. Got a basement door. Oh, it's probably going to be dark in there. I may not even be able to see much. But here's the backyard. See what's going on back here. Anything? Got a little shed. A lot of treeage. Wilderness. Yeah, this house needs quite a bit of work, huh? Got a little snow on the roof. Back door, front door. That's because it's a lot of front yard, exactly. <laughs> this man got a little backyard, but a lot of front yard. So, yep, this is our subject property. It's already. Let's see if we can go inside, see what they're talking about. Hope it ain't nothing bad in here. Hope no boogeyman ain't waiting for me. It's been vacant for quite a while. And like I said, this house next door vacant too, it looked like. I don't like this front door, I'll tell you that already. This mug definitely been vacant for a minute, huh? Is that a bird's nest up here? An overgrown bird's
business. All these things that are all the window have been busted out of them. All right, let's see if this code works. Let's see if the code gonna work. Okay, how do you use this lock box? Hopefully I'm doing this right. Ugh. I ain't never even seen a lock box like this. How do you use this thing? Hmm. This is one of them new kind. Hold on. Time out. I ain't never even seen a lock box like this. How do you get this thing open? Hmm. All right, hold on. I got to work some magic to try to get into the house now. Sit right there. I can't get in if I can't get in. Hold on. Maybe I got the code wrong. There we go. If I put in the right code, it'll open. Hey, how magical was that? Uh, we got keys, baby. Here we go. Hello? Damn. That mother need a lot of work. Is that floor safe? <laughs> Subfloor good? You want to make sure your floor good. Got a little slant up here on the front. I can see it kind of dipping or something over there. Just don't dip too much. Yeah. So that's the kitchen, I guess. And it's the living room, I guess. He said, wow. So yeah, definitely need some work. No question about that. Yeah, this roof or ceiling or whatever. I hope ain't nothing fell in here, no animals. Squeaky, squeaky, squeaky. Big spider webs up there. Damn. I'm gonna need a lot of work, man. Yeah, that's about what, 30K or more? That's a mold, fresh mold for you. The basement looked pretty dark. At least you got a hot water heater still here. Somebody looked under there to see if there was any pipes I see, huh? That's what that means when you see that opened up in the room. Mm -hmm. Kind of janky. Let's see what we got back here. You want to do like that, make sure you don't walk to no spider webs. This, ooh, is that mold? Get the hell out of here. Is that mold? What's that? Don't breathe too much. But yeah, it's kind of rough up in here. For sure. Kind of tough, kind of rough. So you like this house so far or what? Bathtub older than me. Little bitty bathroom. The closet. This house is old. Yeah, I don't know. It's a little bit more work than I like. You know, I like to work a little bit. Lazy mug. You lazy. I would go downstairs, but I know it's gonna lose the uh, signal. But yeah, this is the uh, what it looks like. Looks like splattered feces. Exactly. Need gloves. No, I'm just gonna touch it barehanded. The COVID don't exist in these type of places. There's your big. You say, as long as it ain't no chalk outline. 
So I already know it's going to lose uh, signal when I go down in the basement. So I'm about to go down there. I'm going to end this stream. Hopefully y'all saw enough for now. And uh, we'll see what we can do with this house. That's what we got. He said he will sell or finance. So from what I can tell, yes, you will sell or finance. Flashlight and show coverings. Coverings? What's coverings? I can try to go down here, but I'm thinking it's going to probably go out. Let's see. Kind of dark, too. Ooh, hello? Y'all want to go down here? Leave your phone on. It's going to cut off. I don't know. Them steps don't even look too safe. <laughs> well, actually, I've probably seen enough anyway in reality. I mean, it is what it is. It needs a bunch of work. We'll see what they're talking about first. It sounds reasonable, but I, I've definitely probably seen enough to know it needs quite a amount, of, you know, quite a bit of stuff. It's not livable at all. All this have to be redone. All this stuff, the mold in here, yeah, look like it's mold all over here in the kitchen. Look at that, ain't that mold too? Up on the backsplash, we have a mold backsplash covering for all of you that love the green mold. Keep breathing in them spores. So I'm gonna get up out this house actually. Yeah, I'm not going downstairs. I think I'm gonna go ahead and leave. So what y'all think about this house? Should I buy or say bye-bye? What y'all think about it? What do you think? <laughs> Let's see if I can put this lock box back. It's a funny looking lock box. I've never even seen a lock box like this. Hold on. Two dollars now, three, when I go three, now three, now four, when I go four, now five. <laughs> Y'all yeah, silly. Hold on, I gotta fix this lockbox. Close it up and change the code. Hope I can do this right. Here we go. Alright, we're locked back in. Get up out of here. Mm. 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 So somebody need, I need to borrow that dumpster next door and bring it over. Yeah, we can do terms. He said he would do terms on it. So that's the house. Hold on, let me, let me make a good screenshot for y'all. Hold on. Screenshot. Tag me. <laughs> so that's the house. We're going to do some numbers on it, see what we can work out. But it definitely needs plenty of work. Ain't no shortage on work that it needs. And I'll let you know what we do with it. I'm probably not buying it. If I buy it, I'm going to terms it. I'll buy it on terms, sell it on terms, somebody else. Because I'm not doing all that work. That's quite a bit of work. Just keeping it real. So hopefully you saw something you liked today. Hopefully you learned something. Even by accident, let me know. Leave a smart comment. Even if you're watching on the replay. Let me know what you think about this property. And we're going to go from there. Get back in the car. Woo! Cold out here too. It's 40 degrees hell. 40 degrees on this place. Alright. So with all that being said, any other questions, comments, concerns? You say 10 year balloon. How about 30 years? We don't need no 10 years. We need 30 years, baby. Put your seatbelt on. Be safe. You say terms, yes. No down payment. Yep, they can do no down payment. 0% interest. Uh, what else? Yeah, we can do it. 23 degrees here. Yeah, it's, uh, well, it say 37 up there. But it was actually 40 at first, so it went up. Let me see. 37 degrees. How cold is it to you? So hopefully you all liked that video. I haven't did a should I buy or say bye-bye in quite a while. I will catch y'all on the next one. So do what you do. Be who you be. And I'll see you before you see me. Find more leads than you can even process. That's multiple listing service. 
that's the MLS for you real estate agents, absentee owner information, find the cash buyers and flippers in any market nationwide, pull a pre-foreclosure list, and don't forget, you gotta find those comps, get nationwide access with multiple filters, powered by PropStream at WokeSource.com. Get your seven-day free trial today, WokeSource.com. That's WokeSource.com. Get your free real estate joint venture agreement and get notified of upcoming shows. Text JV to 636-330-1444. Today's broadcast is being brought to you by WokeSkipTracing.com. Look up phone numbers and email addresses with ease, with pricing as low as only 15 cents per match. Not per search, per match. If there's no number or email address, you don't pay. Get accurate data in just minutes. WokeSkipTracing.com. That's WokeSkipTracing.com. You may have heard the saying, the fortunes are in the follow-up. Now there's a brand new system that is great to help you code call, text message, drop voicemails, and so much more, all automated. You don't have to remember anything. Just set it and forget it. All you have to do is speak to people. Check it out, WokeReply.com. It's a multi-touch marketing campaign where you can schedule to send text, voicemail, email, and even live calls all on autopilot. Check it out today, WokeReply.com. That's WokeReply.com.